Clerk Venegas, can you test Kobe's microphone, please? Or Trustee Pizzotti's microphone? Mic check, one, two, one, two. <laughs> All hands in the air. No? Yeah? yeah, there we go. There we go. It works. It works. Hey, <laughs> hey, can everybody hear? Go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, yeah, is it working? I can hear. Can you hear me? Yep. Yep. Okay. Welcome to the special board meet of education meeting, um, the, our annual organization meeting of Board of Trustees uh, at 5 p.m. on December 9th, 2022, um, in the Chambers of West Sacramento, California. So roll call. Trustee Pizzotti? Here. Clerk Venegas? Present. I am present. Vice President Kirby Gonzalez? Present. Okay, we are. Um, we can open our rule now. So, uh, moving on to any public comments. I understand that there are no public comments submitted for this special session. There were no public comments received for the five o'clock meeting. Are there any members of the public who want to make any public comments before our oath or anything? Okay, going once, going twice. Moving on. Um, I have the pleasure of actually calling up um, Dr. Rebecca Lavalle to swear in Vice President Kirby Gonzalez. And to conduct the oath of office. <laughs> like mother, like daughter. Thank you. Welcome back to the dais, Vice President Kirby Gonzalez. And now um, I would like to welcome up uh, Virginia Coffey, uh, yeah. who and the oath of office will be conducted by Don Archuleta. We're going to have you stand in front of the microphone so the audio can hear it. Coffee. The script. Here, if you want to talk into the microphone. Right here. Okay. Mm. Oh, Julius will be swearing you in. So, Julius will be swearing it. Okay. okay, Julius. I, Virginia Coffee. I, Virginia Coffee. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will support. I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States and the Constitution of the State of California Stop. against all enemies. <laughs> 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 Sorry. It's okay. I was like, it's all right. 
and I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States and the Constitution of the State of California against all enemies. Foreign and domestic. Foreign and domestic. <laughs> that I will be bear true faith and allegiance to the Constitution of the United States. That I will bear true faith and allegiance to the Constitution of the United States. And Constitution of the United States of California. <laughs> and the Constitution of the State of California. You're I fine. made up. It's okay. That I will take this obligation freely. That I take this obligation freely. Without any med mental reservation. Without any mental reservation. Or purpose of evasion. Or purpose of evasion. And that I will well and faithfully discharge the duties upon which I am about to enter. And that I will well and faithfully discharge the duties upon which I am about to enter. Wait, that's it? No, you read that too. Oh. Washington <laughs> Unified School District. Washington Unified School District Governing Board Member Trustee Area 1. Great. Yay. <laughs> well, welcome to the day. It's Trustee Poppy. Thank you. Um, uh, before we actually ta I take a point of privilege for us to take a small break to go out to the reception, I want to give um, Vice President Kirby Gonzalez and Trustee Coffey uh, a moment to say you can please welcome to the dais <laughs> if you want to, if, if, if there's anything you want to say. No? Yes. No, it's, it's an honor to serve Washington Unified um, School District Area 5, and I'm very grateful to be on this board and to have another uh, four years here, uh, continuing the good work we're doing with lots of heads. So welcome. We're happy to have you. And it is an honor and a privilege to be up here and seeing it from a different angle entirely. And I'm hoping that I continue to be that voice that I said that I was going to be from the beginning. This is great. I'm excited. Good. Well, welcome. Um, we are going to take a small break right now so we can join um, our newly oathed, is that what we say? Newly sworn in trustees. Um, outside, so please join us. Everyone, join us outside for a small little reception. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> so we're taking a break. Do I need to motion that? Do I need to motion that that we're taking a break? I thought it was okay. A recess. We're taking a recess. Congratulations, Trusty. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I have a bit of a I don't know what You rocked it. You killed it, dude. I know, right? For being a nine-year-old and yeah. saying those words. I, was like, I can't even say those words.
board officers, um, Dr. Hildreth, before I say that, I just wanted to thank you and this board um, and Trustee Barnes, who can't not be here tonight, for actually allowing me to lead you during this past school year. Really grateful for our um, kind of the struggle that we went through during COVID and um, recentering ourselves in the needs of kids and families and community and really excited about uh, doubling down on our strategic plan that are, is rooted in equity and justice. And so grateful for uh, that we can move forward as one team. Um, looking forward to serving with uh, Trustee Coffee, who brings a lot of wealth of, of history and knowledge and um, deep roots. Um, in West Sacramento, and just looking forward to serving in this new term. So with that said, I'm going to hand it over to Dr. Hildreth and for the reorg. Thank you, President Wong. And before we uh, move forward with that process, I would just like to uh, thank you and acknowledge your uh, year of uh, service as president of this amazing district. And I just want you to know how grateful I am for the guidance that you have provided to me as a new superintendent and really um, just helping me lead up and knowing uh, your wealth of knowledge has been so um, essential and helpful to the work that I have been able to lead with the support of all of the trustees and with our staff. So just wanted to publicly acknowledge you um, for your leadership. So thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. So now let's move to the agenda item. And this is our annual organization of board officers. And there's just awareness for our, our public that under the provisions of California Ed Code, 35143, the governing board is required to set an annual organization meeting <coughs> within a 15-day period that commences with the date upon which a governing board elected at that election takes office. And so uh, we announced at our uh, meeting, our previous meeting on November 10th, that on this date, December 9th, we would have the annual organizational meeting date, and this is the meeting where we, um, or trustees, elect a president, a vice president, and a clerk. And so with that, I'm going to turn it over. Okay, thank you. So we will start with the office of the president as we normally do, and after that vote, we will reshuffle um, so that the new president can um, preside over the rest of the meeting. So do we have any nominations for president? I, uh, I actually have three nominations for all of them, just letting everybody know. Uh, um, you know, in, in, in making this nomination, I just want to mention that I, you know, in, in serving this past year, this past two years, um, if, you know, being effective is, is number one for me personally, overall, make, ensuring that our students are put first, ensuring that our uh, that our partners are are being heard and and there's a a, a streamline of of impact and service. Um, so so I've seen this this past year just the the the, the board work um, along with the superintendent just work effectively. Um, and I, and I'm a fan of that. I'm and I'm going to go ahead and put that first. Um, so I would like to nominate Jackie Wong for president for this year. Uh, okay. um, do you have any other nominations for president? Yeah, I would like to nominate Vice President Kirby Gonzalez as rotationally we've done this. Uh, president Wong took over after I was president and she was vice president. It's uh, kind of been a, somewhat of a tradition that this board has followed, uh, as well as Vice President Kirby Gonzalez filled in admirably in President Wong's absence. So. I, I think it's a, uh, a natural succession, as well as um, uh, Vice President Kirby Gonzalez has been president in the past and was very successful in her leadership uh, of the board. Okay. All right, so we have two nominations. I will take it in um, order of nominations first, and we'll go there, and then we'll move forward. So uh, 
Thank you for the nomination. Um, Trustee Coffey. So yeah. So the the uh, the movement is the vote is for uh, Jackie me sounds weird me to continue as president. So I'm voting for you to be president, or so you say yes or no? Yes or no. no. Okay. Trustee um, Vice President Kirby Gonzalez. No. Thank you for the nomination. I will pass. So Clerk Venegas. Okay. Uh, so so now we're moving on to. We're, no, we're going to move on to the vote. Yeah. So no. Sarah. So this is for Sarah. No, no, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm turning to you. Oh, yes. Okay. Yes, yeah. that's right. Yeah. Um, Trustee Kiz Kizadi. <laughs> no, <Okay>. sorry. <laughs> All right. I appreciate the nomination, and we are now going to move on to Vice President Kirby Gonzalez um, for vote as president. So um, with that said, I will start with uh, Trustee Coffey. Yes. Vice President Kirby Gonzalez. Yes. Trustee... Trustee Barnes, not Barnes. Trustee Pizzotti. I don't want to do that with you. Do I look like Trustee Barnes? <laughs> yes, yes. And I'm in, I'm in full support, so yes. And I am in support. So welcome, President Kirby Gonzalez. So we will switch and. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, we have to figure out. Do you want to, do you want to serve from there and then? Yeah. Okay, so then that takes us to, um, thank you, I appreciate that. And that takes us to the vice president. So are there any nominations for vice president? I'd, I'd like, like oh, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, Kobe. I Trustee. would like to um, nominate uh, former clerk Venegas to be vice president. He said no to me. Yeah. I'm going to pass. No. Oh. <laughs> I know. I've got a lot of work coming. I, 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 I. Okay. I understand. Yes, yes. I'd like to nominate Jackie Wong for vice president. Okay. Okay. And you second nomination. I think officially. Oh, oh, yes. yeah. yeah. Okay. And are there any other nominations? Okay. Then we'll take a vote. Trustee Coffee. Yes. Okay. Um, Trustee Wong. <laughs> I vote myself for myself. Yes. And um, Trustee Venegas. Yes. And Trustee Pizzotti. Yes. And I too vote yes. Okay. Okay. And then that takes us to clerk. Do we have a nomination for clerk? I'd um, like to nominate Virginia Coffee. Coffee. Um, I learned a whole lot. It did a lot for me. Um, so I'd like to go ahead and nominate Virginia Coffee. Good job. Yes. Okay. All right. Then we'll do the vote. So I will come. Let's go this way this time. So Trustee Pizzotti. Yes. Okay. Um, Trustee uh, Venegas? Yes. And Vice President Wong? Yes. Okay. And um, Trustee Coffee? Yes. And I too vote yes. <laughs> All right. And that now takes us to um, the committee updates, which we can go into. Um, and I have those here. And usually what we do is. Um, we're pretty open about what people, what committees people would like to be on, and we'll just go through the order. And we have trustees who have been in those places before, but that doesn't mean that they necessarily want to stay or um, that somebody else cannot be there as well. So we'll start with um, the Yolo County School Boards Association, and that has been um, Trustee Venegas. <coughs> um. <coughs> Would you like to stay on that um, role yes, or would I, it? I'd love to continue. Okay. Mm -hmm. And would anyone else like to be in that role? I would like to be back up if is that, is that okay? Yeah. Okay. As a backup? Yeah. Okay. Are we all good with that? I think it just we've learned like it's probably good to get some backups. Yeah, it over is. Time. I think you're right. Okay. Um, okay. Perfect. So now we have our city two by two, and traditionally we do have the school board. Um, president on that. Um, so I would like to be on that. And we also have um, Vice President Wong is on that. Would you like to continue on that? And I, I'm okay. I can uh, defer to some other people who want to be on the two by two. So uh, Trustee Pizzotti wants to be on. Trustee Coffee, would you like to be on the city two by two? Oh, he does. I know. Oh, he does. Pizzotti wants to be okay. on. Okay. I see your hand up. All right. I'm good with that. Okay. 
Then there you go. Trustee Pisati, uh, you and I will be on that. And then an alternate for that. I don't have an alternate on here. I think I was the alternate last you time. Would alternate. you like to be the alternate for that? I can. you like to be the I alternate? Can, I can be okay. the alternate. Okay. Um, so Trustee Venegas is the alternate. Are you getting all this <laughs> as we go? Okay, good. Uh, next up is the county two by two committee. And um, last up, I was on that, as was um, Trustee Barnes, and I know that Vice President Wong has been on that as well. We were on that together. Um, I'm okay um, changing that if other people would like to be on the county two by two. I'd like to join the county two by two. Good. Okay. And would anyone else like to be on the county two and by two? This is uh, different from the county school, county human, health and human mm -hmm. services. Are you interested? Yes. Okay. All right. That sounds good. So we will have. Vice President Wong and Sir Coffee. And then for an alternate, I can be the alternate for that one. Oh, Kobe raised his hand. Oh, sorry. No, that's fine. That's no, fine. We'll... You want to be alternate. Okay. You both can be alternates because that's true. We can just keep. Is there a sequence in which you want to be first and second alternate? Um, Trustee Pizzotti, sure. you be the cool. alternate, and then I can be a backup. <laughs> okay. I know. We Sometimes we, we need go that. through them. <laughs> All right. Um, great. So that takes us now to the curriculum committee. And uh, Vice President Wong was on that last time around, and we have an opening as well. So you like to I'm that open again, to, or? yeah, I'm open to anything. I'm open okay. to opening up that seat for others who may be interested, former okay. teachers maybe. Yes, Are you I would like okay. to be on that. Do you like to do that? Anyone else? Toby, do you want to be on curriculum again? I can uh, do. What? Oh, I'm writing. Sorry. <laughs> curriculum? Uh, no, thank you. Yeah. Okay. Um, I am. I'm looking at what I'm on. I'm just on this one, so I could do that one with you. Okay. And I will get back onto that. And would anyone like to be an alternate? Have to be the alternate. Okay. Thank you, Vice President Wong. Next is Facility commi um, Committee, which has been um, Trustee Pizzotti and Trustee Venegas. I'm okay to stay on or to open it yeah, up. Yeah, me too. Okay. Yep. I think that's good considering there's a lot of historical work that you've been doing on that. So, who about that? Okay. Do we have any uh, backup? Who would like to be an alternate for that? I'll be an alternate. Oh, perfect. Okay, and the last one is the policy committee, and uh, Vice President Wong is the delegate, so she is automatically on that, and I've been on that as well, um, and I like doing that work, but if anyone else would like to do policy, they could do it. You'd like to do that? Mm -hmm. Okay, you got it. All right, so Clerk Coffey and <laughs> President Wong, and I can be the alternate if we're good with yeah. that. Okay. <coughs> okay, sound good? All right. President Kirby Gonzalez, there is an additional committee okay. that I would like to propose okay. that we have a budget a finance mm -hmm. subcommittee. We have, um, we want to make sure that um, we have time to discuss very important finance matters in the same way that we're able to uh, discuss our curriculum, our policies, our facilities. And so that's a new subcommittee that we would like to um, propose to begin for um, starting in January going okay. through this year. So if you all are in agreement, if we could um, have two members and an alternate who would like to be on the finance and budget subcommittee. I'm thinking so, in the so past. So we have to vote to establish it. Oh, okay. And we, I feel like the policy committee wrote up what a description would be, do we, or do we just vote on it? That's how we did it last time. Although, um, if we want to vote to approve two members to then craft that, um, yeah. So is this so is this action from staff that you this this is the the write up, um, Superintendent Hildreth? So the request is, oh. is to establish it. Yes. Okay. okay. And the, the, that's the justification. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank. You. And so I think we need to vote to establish the committee, mm -hmm. and then um, I, I guess. And one fell swoop. Like, mm -hmm. are we are we okay? I guess that's up for discussion. Yeah. I think that makes sense yeah. because it gets 
finances get weedy to have yes. a finance committee. Yes. And given all the timelines and everything that's going on between everything, all the budgeting, all the changes in budgets and what's going on, I think right. it makes good sense. But um, other, I'm open to hearing others. So I hear. No, I, I actually think that makes a lot of sense. And it seems like it's a. Uh, Something we probably should have done a while ago. It's definitely a good, good subcommittee for us to have. And I think I remember hearing at CSBA many of the school boards had had one already, which make, makes a lot of sense. So I'm trying to see how this is written on here in terms of and in terms of approving it because we don't have it listed on here to approve it. Um, but we do have selection for board committees, and so. Um, in terms of making an approval of it, um, we can add the approval of this meeting, or we could put, we have another December meeting where we could officially put it on. Yes. And then we could approve it, if, okay. you know, and put it there for approval. Okay. Um, just on process. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. Sounds good. So let's do that. Think about if you want to be on that committee. And then if we put it on board governance, then we can approve it and at the same time pick two pick people two for it. Perfect. Yeah. Thank you so much. Okay. All right. Are there any downsides? I, I didn't hear. I just, I, Kobe and I said yes, but I didn't hear. Does any anyone have any objection to doing this committee? Yeah. Okay. Um, well, then we have um, our adjournment uh, for this meeting. And I'm looking at our um, schedule because our next meeting officially begins at six. So I think we have another break <laughs> as we go in. So we will adjourn this meeting um, right now, and then we will do our next meeting at six o'clock. Right. Hey, thanks guys. Oh, that's right. We have to take you off. Oh, yes. Like he can't be, he can't be at this meeting. Bye, Kobe. Bye. 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 <laughs> thanks for playing.